coming in. And Starter lets them go over two miles and five for the Wiggly Group maiden hurdle on their way down towards the first of 11. Conceal was the leader going out over the first. And we lost Bill, Big Bill Wrigley, who's blundered and unseated Harry Bannister at the first flight. Teenage Dirtbag not at present pursuing Conceal with Patroclus soon prominent racing keenly as they jump the second flight of hurdles, which Cape Milano made a bit of a mistake at. Currently at the back, the likes of That's the Badger and Fantastic Lady. Glenn Moore is settled in the last trio. As they come to jump the third, Conceal in the light blue. Teenage Dirtbag, who was rather slow and rather got in the way of Patroclus. Not at present in dark blue and red. On the outside of the white-faced Lisitsky, who's also in dark blue and red, both prominent. WB, who's taken a keen hold, is on the heels of the leaders. So too is the quiet Don towards the outside with Madame Deluxe, another who's not far behind as they work their way around the turn and into the home straight. Teenage Dirtbag alongside Conceal, followed by Patroclus and Lisitsky, and not at present. WB and Madame Deluxe right in behind them with the quiet Don. Kate Milano's following Patroclus through on the inside. Over the first of the home straight, Conceal remains the leader. They're all out safely over that. That's the Badger remains the back marker with Fantastic Lady, Glenn Moore going wide in rear. Grand Lord is held up towards the back along with the young warrior as Conceal leads them over flight number five. So up in front of the enclosures, Conceal and Daryl Jacob by two lengths to Teenage Dirtbag, not at present, and WB with Lizitsky remaining prominent. Then follows Patroclus, The Quiet Don, Madame Deluxe, Kate Milano. Minella Royale is buried away in the mid-division. That race is next in front of Grand Lord. And then follows uh, JBY, who's racing on the outside of De Young Warrior. Fantastic Lady still in rear, together with That's the Badger. As they come to jump the flight of hurdles on the side, Conceal with the riderless Big Bill Wrigley for company as they come over the sixth. Teenage Dirtbag again missing out of the hurdles and again Kate Milano made a mistake back in the field. So swinging left-handed to go up the hill. It's Conceal from not at present on the outside of Lizitsky. Then follows Patroclus and Teenage Dirtbag who are followed up the hill by WB and Kate Milano and Madame Deluxe and Minella Royale. The Quiet Don losing its place is next. Then the Young Warrior and Grand Lord who race either side of JBY. Glenn Moore and Fantastic lady behind those and that's the badger continues to race last but he's still very much in touch so they're on the descent to the back straight conceal leading them down the hill by a couple of lengths from Patroclus on the inside of Teenage Dirtbag, not at present. Then Lizitsky, who's just a half length back in front of WB. Then follows Madame Deluxe, The Quiet Don, Kate Milano, Minella Royale in front of JBY, who's ridden quietly in front of Grand Lord, who's having to work. Glenn Moore around the outside, ticking them off one by one. The young warrior right up the inner is beginning to make progress. Fantastic lady still towards the back and that's the badger will be the last to pick up at flight number seven which the leaders are taking now conceal still at the head of affairs from wb and patroclus who race either side of not at present with the young warrior making significant headway up the inside as they come to jump the fourth last minella royale and glenn moore going wide are both making headway conceal from wb over the fourth last not at present in third then follows Patroclus, the young warrior, Minella Royale is just behind those, then Lizitsky, JBY making headway from the rear, Fantastic Lady also beginning to improve. Going over three from home, Patroclus and not a present have joined the longtime leader, Conceal, the young warrior is front rank, so too is WB, JBY on the heels of the leading group, then follows Fantastic Lady, Minella Royale and Glenn Moore, and they've gone clear of Kate Milano, and that's the Badger, who's now never near 
Conceal leading them back towards the home straight by a half length from Patroclus. JBY has moved smoothly into third off the home turn. Then WB from Not at Present. And after those is De Young Warrior who's beginning to fade. Manella Royale and Fantastic Lady behind those. Conceal Patroclus joined in the centre by JBY who led out right at the second last and now set sail for home. Between the final two flights, JBY under Tom Bellamy has readily gone clear, quickened away by seven or eight lengths, jumping the last, which he winged. Patroclus over in second, De Young Warrior rallying in third, and then Fantastic Lady. But JBY is impressive in winning this by a wide margin without coming off the bridle. Tight second between Patroclus and De Young Warrior with Fantastic